you welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new today's gonna be a really fun one we are decorating this little one's play area for the Halloween fall season so if you guys like decor that is not so so spooky but perfect for kids this video is for you make sure you give this video a thumbs up and guys let's get decorating and making it super cute super cozy and not spooky at all. guys so we got the sofa styled with our cute little pillows um, I will when I go to do the final walkthrough I'll tell you where I got everything from but the pillows I think they are all from Target dollar spot over the years but um, we hung up our little garland another Target dollar spot find and then um, we're about to decorate the little blanket ladder. This room up here is Brooklyn's um, play area. So inside all of these cabinets is toys and we have baskets with more toys. So this is kind of like, this is your area, right? Yeah. So we like to make it super festive and super fun. we always change out our books or add books to our um, Brooklyn's book area in her room that go along with the season um, another great resource if resource if you're switching out books and you're low on storage or you just don't want to um, have a stockpile of books you can go to your local library we will also go to our local library grab some additional books but these are the ones that we have in our collection the first one is this halloween bedtime story so a bunch of wonderful disney stories but they have a little halloween twist so this is a great one to read for bedtime um the next one if your kiddos love a pop-up book it is um, in a spooky haunted house um, this book is really cute and really sweet and it's just fun like kids always love a little pop-up book the next one is Pete the cat and it's the five little pumpkins Pete the cat books are such classics and this is just a really cute one and it's great to help with counting and all of that stuff Next, if you're littles, maybe it'll drive you a little bit crazy, but um, if they love to press the buttons and that goes along with the stories, here is a Paw Patrol one and you make your way through a maze, but it also has the buttons. I won't, I'll spare you guys and not press it now, but it has the buttons that you can press and you hear the different sounds that coordinate with the story. Um, you wanna show them the next one, Brooklyn? So here's a pumpkin book. It's a fun book. It says how many pumpkins and every pumpkin bite. 
like leaves a pumpkin they go like down to like like little numbers yeah this is five little pumpkins so another great one for counting and here's the next one's a Halloween book and it has like monsters in a Halloween house and the kids like visit this house and then get scared of yes. this house. Um, I do want to preference this. All of these books are totally like um, easy, kid friendly, but this one is The Night Before Halloween and it's a really cute book to read the night before that special trick or treat day because some kids may be a little bit scared of being in the dark during that <laughs> time because typically that's the time that we go trick or treating. <laughs> the next one is The Spooky um, Express. Virginia and this is a sweet story as well. You can always tell all of our books are very much loved but um, this is a train story about a little spooky adventure. And here we have Pete a cat and it has like things like every time you see you read it every time you do this and you'll see it and then you go back and you will see a witch flying in the air. Yes, we love a good Pete the Cat book, and this is a flip book, which is always fun for kids. And here's the next one. You have a maze, so you pick your fingernail and cross it every time it goes to Then you pick your finger like this and try to make it to the end. So this is a fun one. It's an interactive book, so follow me Halloween. So it's fun little mazes for your little to follow and cute little scenes. And here's the next one. You can like seal the pumpkin, ask the eyes and everything, you turn it. You can put your face in there. Yes, and this mm -hmm. is called um, Halloween Jack, so a funny face book. So you can put your face in, because we know our pumpkins have many, many faces. <laughs> Okay. Yeah. This one is a classic. This was actually my husband's, um, his parents used to read it to him when he was little. It's called Scary Scary Halloween. <laughs> it's a sweet little story, but we love this one and it's just really special for our family. And here's the next one, Lion's World. And it has like, comes with stickers and um, it's a Halloween book. And you can like them play challenges and you can put stickers where it goes. Yeah, so fun little, if your kids are obsessed with, like my kid is, Ryan's World, a fun little Halloween sticker Ryan book. And, and you can like, he has a channel too. Yeah, he does have a channel. So the last book is 10 Orange Pumpkins, another sweet counting Halloween book that we love to read, right? Yeah, and I'll show you inside this book. So here it comes with this. See, Halloween days are like a versus covered. Yeah, and the numbers go down and down and down. It's like subtraction, yeah. right? Like down, down, it goes to zero, and then they come back. Yes. Yeah. So that is our little Halloween collection. Like I told you, we will add books from the library as well to just round it out. And each year I like to get her a book or two. So this has taken us a while to um, build up, but yes, we love changing out our books just to make it that more festive for this season. Last but not least, Brookie loves to decorate her little house for um, Halloween as well. Mm -hmm. So it's actually not a little house. It's pretty big. It is from Amazon. We've had it for about a year. We moved. We bought it when we moved to our Texas house, and um, it's just great and it's so fun. What is your favorite thing about your house? My favorite thing because I can play dolls and decorate it. Yes. So we're gonna decorate it. We have like some ghosts and we have a few pumpkins that she painted last year and we're gonna put those in it as well. And then we will do our overview guys. So almost at the finish line, but everything is coming Yay! out <laughs> so cute.
right guys we are all done so in here we have her little ghost that garland is from target many years ago and then her little painted figurines and some hobby lobby pumpkins she has a little witch down there and like i said her house is from amazon we put a little um disney ambiance on the tv for halloween she has this pretty garland that is um, burlap, has the cats and the pumpkins. That is from Target Dollar Spot as well, a few years back. This boo sign, super duper cute. That is from, you guys, I always find the best stuff. In California, we had Albertsons and I got that from Albertsons, super cute. Over here on the blanket ladder, we just have this little trick-or-treat bag and a little witch's broom in there. Both of these are from the Target dollar spot. Another Target dollar spot find. When we're currently filming this, it's 67 days, but by the time I have it up and going for you guys, it would be less days until Halloween. And then down here, we just put in some Target Dollar Spot pumpkins and then another little pumpkin from um, Albertsons back in California. So like that. Here we have this chair. This chair is from Amazon. The leather pillows from Amazon and that cat is from Hobby, not Hobby Lobby, Target Dollar Spot last year. We did a little vignette on this table, Brooklyn did. So she has, this little ghost was a gift. We have just some gauze from Michael's. Target dollar spot, Target dollar spot, Target dollar spot. Her whole playroom is bought to you by Target dollar spot. And then on this sofa here, we just have um, two Target dollar spot pillows that are super duper cute. But we're gonna pan back and I will show you everything all together and it just looks cute and adorable and cozy and not spooky at all last spot she has her little amazon kitchen target dollar spot tea towel and these figurines are actually from cvs and then this is a little cute cvs pumpkin so her kitchen is decked out for halloween and this fall season so that is it guys we want to thank you so much for watching this video also her little cute little shirt you want to stand up and show them it is from walmart this year and then my little <laughs> pumpkin shirt is from target so um super cute super cozy but we want to thank you guys so much for watching if you enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and we will see you very soon with a whole new one bye guys happy halloween Happy Halloween! <laughs>